shall not always strive to be. Whoa. Wait. Stop. You mean my opportunity can run out? What do you think? God's stupid. The only people in heaven is the one that want to be there. Nobody's there that didn't prepare. Amen. Nobody. He said, my spirit shall not always strive with man for that he also is flesh. Mm. Yet his days shall be a hundred and twenty years. No one is going to cross that threshold. God drew the line right there. Somewhere between then and now. You need to make sure you get your life right with God. Amen. Make sure you call on Jesus' name. I wrote these last words, listen. And whether you're lost, saved, it doesn't matter right now. Jesus loves you. Someone is praying for you in heaven and on earth. Prayers are going up. God has sent the Holy Ghost to plead with you this morning for your soul. If God can open the curtains up and you can see the spirit realm right now, you will see a war going on in the heavens fighting for your soul. The archangel Michael and Gabriel engaging in battle with the prince of Glendale. There's a demonic angel out here. Why do you think the guy got shot over there in Glendale? Just like anywhere else, there's a battle going on. Amen. As we bow our heads right now, and as we close our eyes, as unto the Lord, God's talking to some folks in this building. He's tugging right now on some of the hearts of those that are here. How long will you halt between two opinions? How long will you wait? How long will you put it off for another time, another day? Don't you say, God, here I am this morning. I learned something this morning that your love is deeper than I've ever thought. And you love me with a dying love that you died for me. And now if you died for me, the least I can do is live for you for the rest of my life. Maybe you're in this building this morning and God's tugging on your heart. I wonder if you said, Preacher, I'm making up my mind. I am going to live for the Lord God Almighty. I am going to serve Him with everything that I have because I love Him. If that's your prayer this morning, will you slip your hand up and say, Preacher, will you pray for me this morning? I want God in my life. Will you pray for me? I need the Lord. I need.